Nduru Kinata has now defended his move to appoint former Vice President Moody Awori as a member of an oversight board, uh, board to manage sports, arts and uh, social development fund. Uhuru spoke a day after Kenyans expressed their frustrations and dismay on social media over the news stating that he was too old for the job that he had been given. Kenyatta has, however, maintained that his move is one way of protecting public funds from being looted by youth, many of whom have been linked to corruption in the different sectors of the Kenyan economy. Our reporter, Cicely Wakesho uh, Maduva, with that report. This was the reaction of Kenyans on social media on Wednesday when news broke that 91-year-old former Vice President Moody Awori had been appointed as one of the seven members of the Oversight Board to manage sports, arts and social media funds. Netizens on Twitter will not take it lightly. A day later, and President Uhuru Kenyatta would have answers to those faulting his move. I'm being criticized. I could see yesterday Uko, that I'm appointing a 91-year-old to, to look after the youth sports fund. Lakini Jameni, let me put you, you put yourself in my shoes. Ukiwana vila watu wanaiba pesa. Mimi afadhali nikaya na uyo mzee bana achunge yu pesa, itumike vila inatakikana. Yeah, this comes when there has been increased public outcry on how qualified youth are languishing in poverty due to unemployment. According to 2018 Skills Mismatch Report by the Federation of Kenya Employers, 39% of degree holders in the surveyed firm work as clerical officers, 30% as secretaries, 20% as receptionists, and 9% were casual laborers. The report further indicates that 36% of master's degree holders were in positions meant for degree holders. Sasa munataka tuende na tumeona vile watu wakipatiwa kazi kama hiyo vile wanaenda kufanyafanya. Si afadhali tupatia huyo mzee achunge ndiyo iwarudi. Ah, watu waniwache bana mimi sitaki mambo mingi. Ironically, in a report published by John Gidongo in 2006, Moody Awori was linked to a multi-billion angry leasing scam. In May this year, a photo by the Chief Administrative Secretary of the Ministry of Public Service and Youth, Rachel Shebesh, showing not so youthful leaders at a workshop on matters youth, was highly condemned by Kenyans on Twitter. Last month, during a funeral mass of the late Archbishop John Jenga, Uru had a special message to Moody. Moody, usiwe na haraka, we still need you. <laughs> usiwe na haraka mingi, ubado kuna miaka mingi. Eh, hey, don't be in a hurry to join him. <laughs> Serve us for a little bit longer here. Other appointments that have sharply been questioned include that of 71-year-old Francis Mudaura, who was appointed as the chairman of Kenya Revenue Authority Board, 75-year-old Chris Sobure as the chief administrative secretary in the Ministry of Transport, and Matt Wamai, whose tenure at the age of 79 as KCC board chairman has been extended to 2020. Cecilia Keshomadova, Kate News.